Do me a favor, please. Now, try to think of one thing you love, which you really spend time on, and always talk it to your friend. Well, do you think you are wasting time when you do that thing? Of course not, because you have passion for it. From kids' perspective, playing video game is not wasting time. According to the research, shows that a graduate high school student spent ten thousand hours on video games, which makes them become experts. We are living in the age that technology is one of our tools, so avoiding it is is impossible. Because if we want, we can play video games on our tablet, computer, smartphones, PSP, basically everywhere. So why not change our mind and find its advantages? Recently, there is a popular game called Glory of Kings. It is a game for entertainment, and the young generation loves it. If we switch an angle, some specials will show up. This game involving four skills, which are identified as the most important skills for 21st century education, which are communication, collaboration, creativity, and critical thinking, which also called as four Cs. In this game, if a player wants to win, the player must know well about all the hero's character, their skills. And their equipment. This is a kind of critical thinking, but that is not enough. He must know well about how to communicate with other team members and a collaboration together. If so, the game can cultivate students' ability as same as education. Why not apply the game into our classroom? Game-based learning is a concept popular among all educators, and it. Which is involving game into classroom. According to the team editor, that game-based learning is a type of game play has defined learning outcomes. Game-based learning is designed to balance subject matter with game play and the abilities of the players to retain and apply said subject matter to the real world. Now, as a parent, you may have many concerns, like playing video games make people's eyesight worse. But general wisdom carries no weight. According to the research, shows that gamers' version is better than non-gamers because players can see more details. Games is interactive. It teaches us how to achieve goals, to follow the rules. Also, adaptation, problem solving, and interaction. Besides, it can cut through discrimination. All players just focus on game, regardless gender, age, race, nationality, and so on. Eliminate discrimination. Isn't it one of the goal of education? Games are favorite. And it has significant number of positive aspect. So why not apply it into our classroom? Why not let the kids spend their game time for educational purpose? Thank you.